Today was a light day for the bench press. Started off with the bar, moving it to 95 pounds. Just getting the warm up in. Cranked out a few reps, went to 135. Benching kind of wide today, just going light. Got some reps in. Then I went to 225. I usually like to do when warm ups happen, do a 25, then a plate, and then another plate, and then another plate, and so forth. I try to get all my reps done with the lower weights. Then went to 315. Got set up in the bench press, plowing my shoulders, or actually traps into the bench, lowering the weight, pressing it. One, two, get some rep work in. Rack the weight. Here's my second set. I wish I was able to lower the weights faster, but I just don't feel comfortable lowering weights faster. So I end up wasting a lot of energy, unfortunately, on lowering the weight. But once I get it in groove, I can press it fast. Then afterwards, I went to incline presses. Start out with 135. Remember, this is just a light day. So here I am, cranking out some reps. Some people like to move on to inclines and just start with their top weight. I kind of like to do a warm up set and just add weight or pyramid up on my second movement. I just do not feel comfortable going heavy. Although you can, but I just don't feel comfortable. I'm doing the inclines at a very high point on my chest and trying to do a closer grip than normal. This is a good stretch and also it's good for the triceps. There we go, cranking out those reps. Inclines are good for upper chest and they're also good for, if you're a raw bench presser, it's a great exercise to incorporate. and adjusting the plates. I like to use plates sometimes. It's not because I'm too short or so forth, but it allows me to actually get a better leverage on pressing. Here I am making sure my hands are inside the grip. Everything's lined up, lift off. Then lower the weight. I found that when I bench press higher, I can't necessarily always go down low and touch. This is another movement I do for triceps. This is a safety bar JM presses. If you have a safety squat bar, give these a try. Of course, start off light, and then in a matter of weeks or in a matter of training sessions, increase the weight. There's really if you work your triceps, basically what you're doing is you're lowering the weight like you would in a bench press, and then you're rolling it the bar back and then rolling the bar forward into a tricep extension. Then afterwards, did press downs using a rowing handle. What I like about this, this particular exercise is it just feels different. It really flexes the triceps. So if you have one of these, give these a try also. You can keep your reps whatever you prefer, but I like to keep my reps on press downs anywhere from, I'd say 10 to 20. And as far as sets go, I will do anywhere from two sets to four sets. 